Hey guys, welcome back to another video on Catan Universe. Looks like we're going to be playing in second position here. Okay. So taking a quick look at this board. Let's see here. Wheat is all clumped up together up here. Hmm. Can't do anything without wheat. So we're going to have to get a decent wheat spot going in second position. I'm looking 483. 483 building towards sheep port. That would be my ideal placement. Uh, if that is going to be blocked. And then, oh, wow. Okay, so there, I mean, let's see, do we still go with this? I mean, I still say yes, uh, just to be able to expand to 8, eight 10. We could play or we sheep, and there should be other opportunities to um, get brick and wood. Yeah, even if we just get one down here. Hmm. Let's see. This would be nice too. Who knows if that's going to be left over for us. But worst comes to worst, we could always just expand off of just playing with the sheep port. Uh, so yeah, I am liking this and we could expand on ore, getting um, ore monopoly here. Uh, so yeah, I would say let's go with that. Building towards sheep port. Let me know what you guys think about that first initial replacement. I know we could have uh, went higher with production, maybe going 6.5. 11 but what will we do with all of that wheat we just need some wheat intake and now if we do secure uh this 810 then uh we have the bet two best or spots on this board so that's another reason i really like that spot okay so red taking total control of all the wheat up here and going for the wheat port they're going to be missing sheep Okay, so so far, next ideal placement for us would be 463. So let me just take a quick look at this board. Let me make sure I'm not missing anything. Uh, if we do take this, then we could expand up to get 38 as well, and also could expand to 114. I feel like the sheep port wouldn't be that beneficial to us. So we're going to uh, build our summit here, point up. Let me just make sure one more time that I'm not missing anything. Okay. I think we're good to go here and we get a free road which will help us secure uh, 810 assuming no one's gonna take 810 okay nice so yeah this is gonna work out for us here I think we're debating where to point the road uh, they know they're not gonna make it they're not gonna beat us if we go if they go this way so yeah next logical answer so we might miss out on 11-4 because uh, I'm going to focus up on 3-8 uh, over here, uh, over 11-4. So that's fine. As long as we secure uh, another sheep spot. I know it's the same number, but still. Okay, so let's roll here. 7. Okay. Who else started with a brick other than us? Okay, so it looks like silver did. Um. So let's hit here. Let's deal from... Okay, we just get wood. All right, regardless, we're just going to build our road here. Get ready to build a settlement on 810. Then we could just get ooh, a bunch of sheep for Aprils. And again, especially if we build out this way. Okay, you're going for... Are you going for the sheep port or are you just going for 10-5? Okay, 9. We get nothing for 9. Hmm. Eight again, nice. Okay, it's gonna be really sweet once we get this secured. Wonder if we could try trading at this point. Uh, not a lot of brick is out there at this point, and Gray used up the one brick that they started with. So no seven again. Oh, we're gonna get so hated here. Um, hmm. Where else makes sense to hit? So you could do this and steal from yellow. I, okay. Hmm. Could maybe do a four for one next turn, depending on what we have. I don't know if it's wise to just uh, burn it right now, but we'll see if it pays off for us to just hoard it and see what we actually need for a four for one trade during our next turn. Okay. So yeah, brick is pretty scarce at the moment, especially with the best brick spot being blocked by me. So I might actually have to do a 4 for 1 trade uh, to get a brick. 
Okay, six. We get some wood for six. I think it was seven at the moment. Maybe I should have done it. Last orbit. You never know. It could be an off chance that a three is rolled. Okay, so red just did a two for one. Green for brick. We'll keep that in mind if they don't use it this turn. Um, I guess you're going to build up for 11, 12. We're going for one of the three for ones, which still wouldn't make sense since you're sitting on the two for one wheat, which is your best resource. Hmm. Yeah, why would you need a brick at this point? I guess you want to expand regardless, but... Okay, you're going down, you're trying to take... Huh. Okay. You want to double up on your six, maybe? That still wouldn't really make sense. And uh, the brick port wouldn't help you out. Yeah, because you you're going to have a deuce and maybe three, so... Roll here seven. Oh my goodness. Okay, do that. Um, hmm. So we can steal from red, try taking a grain. That's the next. We, <laughs> we've stolen from everyone at this point, and that made everyone angry. So, I mean, <laughs> it's just the luck of the roll at that, that point. I've just been rolling so many sevens, but three sevens in a row on our turn. So, it can't be super mad at us, right? So ideally, next, we want a 6 to be rolled, then we do a 4 for 1 trade. Uh, wood for brick. Finally take this spot. Okay, you're expanding out here. Are you going for 11-4 as well? Let's see here, gray. Yeah, I could see you You need sheep. So, yeah, that makes sense. You could also expand to try taking 10-8, ruining our, our chances over there. Uh, we do not need any extra sheep right now, so we're going to pass on that. Okay, six again, nice. So we do have that extra wood that we could use for four for one trade our turn. And even if we do roll seven, we're not gonna lose our resources. At this point, no one has purchased a dev card yet. Still looking for brick, but I let's see a five. Five has been rolled zero times. Uh three has also been rolled zero times, so not a lot of brick going out there for people. So let's roll seven again. Wow, that's the fourth time. My goodness. Um, yeah, we're just going to do this. We're just going to be on a rotating, <laughs> uh, attacking people, unfortunately. Yeah, they, they got to be pissed at us. Okay, so let's build the settlement there. Double up on our eights, and now we have the sheep port. Next target is 3-8 over here, because there's too much competition going on for 11-4. Uh, yeah, still trying to get brick, but at this point, no one has it. Unless you're doing trades for it. Sheep for wood. Nope. Hmm. They just throw out like a wild card? Like nothing? <laughs> just try to trade anything? Yep. Two cards. Uh, What two cards would help you? I guess you, do you want to build road? Okay, 10. We're getting some four for 10. Hmm. I guess if I were to drop a city, the one that makes most sense is 483. The city up first. Six, we get another wood for six. Someone in the comments pointed out that um, like the players on Catan Universe seem easier than the players on uh, Colonist, where that might be true right now because the ranking system is a little bit messed up. I'm not sure if we're being paired with our actual ranks. I did check my player ranking and I still am a grandmaster, but the elo is kind of messed up. Like it's the same. My elo is one thousand, but I'm a grandmaster, and I think grandmaster elo was like thirteen hundred and above, something like that. So it's still a little messed up, but at least we're able to get in some matches here. So six, we got wood for six, and I'm not even gonna bother trying to trade right now because everyone just needs wood to progress. So not an option for us. A four, we get wheat and sheep. We could get a start on buying dev cards. That is a possibility. We or sheep for we. Uh, we're just gonna hold off right now. Yeah. Red has ten cards currently. Eight, nice double. We or double sheep for eight. So we could do a two for one trade, get brick, and start making our way up for three eight. And then we can focus up on cities and devs. Uh, if we take this. Maybe we could expand to 
Uh, wow. Mm. Where are you going for? Try to take this from us, perhaps? Or are you just going to build a settlement there? Hmm. Well, it's too late. Too late for us to make that trade. Anyways, four grain for two brick. Okay, so you're going to build two roads. Go over here. That's what I think you're going to do. Yep. Longest road. Okay, making yourself a target. Pretty early. Okay, six. We're going to get wood for six. Yeah, I think it makes more sense to secure another settlement before I start focusing on devs right now. Uh, ten. Uh, get another ore. Mm, yeah, I still think it's the... Because, yeah, we can't get a city unless... What do people want? Can we do this? Didn't someone want to make this trade? Uh, sheep for wheat. Okay, so they're willing to do it. Wait, it glitched out, maybe. Hold on, let's try it again. It was originally, yeah, okay, yep. Approve, okay, so we'll do that. And we'll do a two for one for that. And now we're able to get a city here. Okay, nice. These are progressing very well for us and uh, yellow turned into a bot. Okay, so now we're getting three sheep every time an A is rolled, which will be eventually be four once we actually get this. Uh, 38, hopefully, depending on what red is going to do. So if they take this, okay, just looking for brick. Unfortunately, uh, five has been blocked by us, and three still hasn't been rolled, so no. And deuce, I guess, but deuce hasn't been rolled either. So yeah, they're kind of out of luck on the, the brick. Two wheat for wood and um, sheep, but at this point, they're just trying to do two one-for-one -one trades, which... It's not beneficial to anyone other than them. Most, most beneficial for them. Uh, 10, we get ore for 10. Hmm. But we could still do a two for one trade for sheep right now. We're sitting with eight cards. Wow, where are you going? Oh no, are you going to take. And we have to ditch. Dang. Uh, That's unfortunate. Okay, hitting that eight. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Wow, okay. Let's roll. We get nine. Get nothing for nine. That's a little unfortunate. We'll likely move, miss out on three eight. Uh, should we start building towards 11 four then? Because they're not getting there as quick. We'll see. Unless we can build two roads and block them, but then they could still just build a summit there and uh, block our placement. But then we could build up towards. Uh, 10 8 and still get another spawn 8. So, yeah, we'll see. Uh, 6, you get wood for 6. Hmm. Okay, a 5. We get nothing for 5. Okay, we'll roll here again. 8. We would have gotten 3 sheep. Um, yeah, at this point, it just makes sense to start progressing at least, maybe to 10 8 if they block off our. 3 8 placement here. 7 by gray. Okay, they had to ditch half their cards and we stole from them a couple of times. At least it's getting moved off of our our 8 sheep. So whatever they decide to hit, it's not going to be as devastating. I guess they could hurt us on the 4, blocking our wheat intake. Hmm. Hitting the 10. Wow, they solo hit us. They didn't even want to. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so they got a settlement there. A five once again. Doesn't yield us anything. Okay, so brick is going to yellow and uh, gray. Okay, hitting us again. Oh my goodness. I mean, it makes a lot of sense. It's a very devastating uh, spot. Six, getting a single wood. Can't do anything with just one resource, so we're just gonna pass a four. Okay, getting a sheep and two wheat for four. Hmm, what can we do with this? Oh, we just need a three. We just need a three, and then we could. Mm, no. Okay, so red has four, or no, has six cards. 
could they get a settlement with six? I mean, it's very possible if a bunch of it is we I think a four roll was rolled recently. Ten, we get ore for ten. Still sitting with six. Can they do it? I've not been card tracking as okay. Nope. They're just trying to deal with the bot at this point with the quick trade attempts. So which leads me to believe they don't have enough resources to get a settlement this turn. Um what could happen, I guess, would be a 7 roll by yellow, and then hitting an 8 would be nice. That could, that could help us get the summit. Oh, you guys are trading on now. Can they do it? 2 green for brick. Yeah, they got the summit there. Okay, that's fine. Move along to the next spot. 6. Okay, getting a wood for 6. At this point, we could start buying dev cards. Let's say, try going for army. Let's roll here, we get a four. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Let's see. What do people want for ore? We do that. Okay, how about sheep? is thinking about it what do you want you want a brick yeah that's not not possible um hmm i just buy a dev card in the spot i guess it could cut me off uh so let's play a defensive road here and just skip on the dev card for now just to secure this spot hopefully unless yellow spontaneously decides to come down this way We'll see eight. We get blocked off on that eight roll once again. So we're just trying to look for brick. I'm not sure what that was. Nothing. Okay. Hmm. But yeah, we do need to start buying dev cards. I should eight again. <laughs> it's down two eight rolls in the same orbit. Hmm. That is all right though. We're not super worried. Two grain for an ore. And you're starting to buy dev cards now. Okay, so they're going to keep road and maybe try to go for army at this point. Uh, nine. Yeah, nothing for nine. Mm, no, we're going to need to keep on that ore so we could buy a dev. Okay, something good for us. Six. Getting a wood for six. Let's try this. Try getting a sheep so we can buy a dev. Hmm. How about wheat? This doesn't work out, then we'll just keep going. Hmm. Still nothing. Do we want to do a four for one trade wheat for brick? But then we're gonna become an even bigger target because people are gonna want to steal our our uh brick. <sighs> okay, let's pass. Let's roll the dice. So I hope it works out. Three? Okay, we're getting some ore and brick for three. Okay, so now we're going to become a huge target because everyone just saw that we got brick. Uh, no, we're just going to hold on to it for now. Could city up if we keep our resources. Um, give me a sheep. Hey, sheep, I'll give you the wheat you're looking for. Okay, so now we can do everything we... We want to do we could build a settlement in a city next turn hopefully uh we'll see what but which is more important mm, i say wow i don't know which is more important actually i would say for us i guess a city would be more important we'll see we just gotta survive two more rolls okay four we get wheat and <laughs> We can shoot for four. Oh my goodness. Uh, no, we don't need that. We have 14 cards. This could be a huge turn for us. You know, that could be beneficial. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't see that being beneficial. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we get. Nine. Oh my goodness. Uh, this is going to be a huge turn. Okay, so settlement. Right, right, okay, and then 
do we want to double up here or here? We could try taking road away from them and converting this will help. And then we could double up on eights. Yeah, let's just city the spot up first. And where do we want to go next? Could build a road and try going for Woodport. Yeah, let's do that. We still can't buy devs yet, unfortunately. Okay, let's do that. We are sitting at four roads currently. Longest road has six, so we have to build seven. Five, we got nothing for five. Two more expansion spots for um, their settlements. We currently have two settlements out, so we still have three settlements to go. Oh, gray is going to take it away from red. Nice. Okay, so road's out of the question. We're just going to try expanding on to get better ports. Uh, deuce, we get nothing for deuce. Red gets, red and gray gets uh, brick. Hmm. We obviously have to attack gray. Moving forward at the spot seven by the bot. Okay. Ooh, still from us anyways. Okay. Didn't make sense. They should be attacking us in gray, but yeah, that four wouldn't make sense for him to attack, I guess. Six. Uh, our wood's blocked for six. Dang. Okay. Yeah, we need to start buying devs desperately. We can. That's going to be the first move that we do. That will get the robber off of us in addition to move us closer to army. Yeah, that's, we need to prioritize devs. We probably should have prioritized devs a little while ago, but we were focused on other things. Okay, Gray, you're going. Wow. Okay. And now Red could cut you off with just one road here, so that's a little bit risky. Uh, seven by Red. You should be mad at Gray for stealing your road, right? I don't think you should keep the, the grudge against us, but... Ah, uh, you are, you are, you guys don't want me to win. <laughs> I mean, again, it makes sense. That's a very high producing spot. Dang, but you would think, oh, and they blocked him off, okay. Uh, three, we get some more brick for three, nice. Okay. We'll roll here, and another three. Hmm. Do we want from this? Yikes. Uh, do I just build another road to get ready for the next spot? Or do I convert? Yeah, we're just going to do this. For it to get ready for uh, another city or a dev. A 10. I'm getting some more ore in wood for 10. I mostly just want to do the 4 for trade just to burn cards so we don't lose it and get the resources that we actually need to progress. Uh, five. Okay, we got nothing for five. Hmm. Okay, deuce. Nothing for deuce. We for... No, that's not a good trade at all. Okay, at this point I'm going for four and eight. Uh, no. Four, eight, or actually... Yeah, no four and eight. Okay. Ten. Okay, getting some more ore. Okay, in this spot, yeah, I feel like it's the right move to do this trade by dev. All right, working towards army. Ooh, we got mono. So if we get a bunch of sheep out there, that would be ideal. Six. Okay. Wood for us. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to keep track of what's going on here. People need sheep. Hmm. What is out there? What is out there? Wow. Great going for the three for one. We used up lumber and brick, so we're not going to do um, mono and lumber or brick. Uh, three. Okay, some more ore and brick going out. Mono and ore? Potentially, after we secure this. Right now we have a bunch of wood. Oh, a bunch of wood. And... No. Who would 
Who would make that trade? No. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we're going to build road here. Next turn. No one has dropped a robber yet, though. So two grain for an ore. They could have a secret uh, victory point since they haven't used that. They've been holding on to that dev card for a while. So I'll place them at five and then just bought another one. Hmm. Okay, what's the right move? Seven. Oh my goodness. Hmm. I guess that's the move because we still need. <laughs> right. Hmm. No, we don't need anything. Okay. What can we do here? Eight. Okay, getting some. Ooh, there we go. Hmm. If I build this. Could we do a mono for sheep? Uh, I still don't feel like there's enough sheep out there. Everyone has a relatively low amount of cards. All right, so let's do that first. And we could do two for one. We still wouldn't be able to get Salmon yet, so. Let's just do the two for one here and uh, buy a dev. What do we get? Okay, knight. All right, there we go. At least progressing towards something that we want to do. Seven by gray. Hmm. Waiting for the right opportunity. I feel like maybe. Do a mod for ore at some point once I have the ore port would be the play. Hmm, we have to slow down red and gray. And I feel like the best spot to do it, I guess, would be the six. No. Yeah, because we need to slow down red so they don't continue to buy dev cards. Uh, we need to slow down gray because they're just dominating the map right now. One, two, three, four. Okay, they only have four. Summit, so they can have another summit here soon. Uh, six, we're getting some wood for six. Yeah, lumber. Mono lumber wouldn't be that beneficial for us. Hmm. Well, lumber for an ore done by red. Bought another dev card. Okay. Yikes. They still have not placed one yet, so we'll still probably be ahead of them in terms of uh, army. Uh, four, getting some sheep and wheat. No, I'm trying to make that trade. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, let's make that trade. We get our settlement next turn. Uh, you want wheat? Give me that. No, you're not gonna. All right. Uh, I don't want to use this knight and then get another card and then roll a seven. So it's going to roll first. Okay, five. I mostly want to drop the knight to progress towards army at this point. So let's do this. And yeah, we're going to steal from you. Okay. So we get the settlement and uh, we don't have enough for dev. At this point, man, let's say we just we just wait because we've been targeted so much that it's probably good to have an influx of cards right now. 12, we get nothing for 12. I'm just getting text messages. Okay, I'm trying to do sheep for. Mm. At this point, I'm going to hold on to my sheep to be able to do trades, two for one trades and um, and devs. So, wow, it would give a lot. Mm. Hmm. 
Where are you? You just want this. Try it one more time. I didn't realize that you were and do just one wood. Sure. We'll do it. Make it happen. Then we can buy dev. Did they deny it? Oh. Yeah. That works out even better. Give me two. Cool. That works. Wait, they didn't even do anything with it. I thought they had a plan, but they're just holding on to it. Now they have eight. Eight cards. Night drop by red. Oh my goodness. Okay, at least next turn we'll be able to buy dev and we'll still be one night up from them if we drop it next turn. Nine. Nothing for nine. Mm. Some lumber out there, some sheep, but still not a lot of sheep. We need some uh ore numbers to be rolled for me to feel comfortable dropping mono for ore. Okay, they finally got Finally, I got the grain that they wanted, I guess. Four brick for an ore. You only have three cards. Dev card again, I believe. Ooh, no, they didn't even do anything with it. Okay. Uh, six. Get some wood for six. Hmm, no. Hmm. Yeah, no, we don't need wheat for brick. Brick is pretty much useless to us at this point. Uh, wheat for sheep. I mean, I guess we could build another settlement up here. That's something we could do. Uh, okay. Let's roll here. And 11. Okay, some wheat going out for 11. A lot of wheat really wouldn't help us out that much. That could hurt all of them. And we mostly want to hurt gray. And taking away their, their wheat might really hurt them. So I might just use it in this spot here. Give me all the wheat. Okay. And then we could do two of these. But then we won't be able to buy dev. Okay. Yeah, I feel like a dev is more important right now. So let's do that. And let's buy another dev. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Ooh, get a victory point. And also all we need at this point is to buy enough devs for us to take army. And we have the victory. So they really can't mess us up that much. Other than just taking all of our resources so we can't buy another knight. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, cool. Got to be gray. I really thought I was taking using the mono to take their wheat would hurt them from doing anything this turn, but they did have a lot of cards. Uh, seven. Seven is rolled by red, and they're at least going to move it off of this eight. Are you going to put it on the other eight? No, they're, that would hurt them. Uh, yeah, a lot of spots that hurt us the most will also hurt them. So, ooh, they're moving forward to it, attacking yellow. Interesting. Obviously, we'll still drop the knight next turn, and hopefully, hopefully we'll have enough for dev. Couple eight, like an eight roll would be so clutch by yellow or myself. Hmm. Okay, nine. We get nothing for nine. Oh no, we might not be able to do anything this turn. Ooh, yes, wood for sheep. Let's do that. No, <laughs> they traded with gray. Okay, so Gray just needs some cities. That's what they need to win in devs, I guess. Um, do we want to do it first? Uh, that being there, it doesn't really affect us either way. So let's just let's roll for seven. Okay. We need... Okay, you got sheep. Also got ore. Okay, so let's double hit. Gray, where do we ideally want it? Okay, eventually we want it there. Let's do this. Steal from you. Drop the knight. Do that. Steal from you once again. Mmm. Try getting an ore. The bot didn't want to make any type of trade. You don't either. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay. Yikes. Okay, so we can't buy dev this turn. We're still... One robber up right now. Yeah, that's, that's unfortunate. 
I was hoping to steal an ore from them, but it didn't work out that way. Eight. Nice. Getting a bunch of sheep for eight. Okay, so hopefully we will have the resources we need next turn to <laughs> seven. Okay, ditching on the wood. Three. Okay, they're gonna hit us here in a second. Steal a sheep, please. Oh, they actually didn't hit us. Okay, nice. I totally thought they were gonna go for us. Okay, so yeah, Gray wasn't able to progress this turn, which was beneficial to us. So we gotta keep them very slow. That's why we double hit them. Okay. Sorry, guys. It's getting a text from the misses. Okay. This turns it red. Okay, so they robbed somebody. They're just trying to calculate what they need to do. They bought a dev card. They're still going to be one night behind us if we could at least buy a dev card this turn. And if we just keep the resources that we have, you're plenty. What are you going to do? Wool and grain. Okay. Yeah, that's not. That doesn't impact us. Uh, eight. Nice. Some more sheep for eight. Okay. Hmm. Trying to think if there's any other way we could win this turn. 10. There's some more wood for 10. We need to buy a dev card, no matter what, to get that knight. Right? Let's see. They're at 11 rows. Yeah, we can't win that way. Don't have enough for two cities. Yeah, we need, we need a knight pull here. Come on. Yes. Okay. Uh. What, how many could we do? How many was that? Whoops. Math is so four. Mm. Okay, so let's do that. Buy another one. Year plenty. All right. Uh, I guess it really doesn't matter at this point what we do. So let's just build one more road here. <laughs> Why not? Okay. So we're dropping night next turn. We'll take the victory. Whew. All right. Yeah, I'm really glad uh, that worked out for us this match. Seven, it doesn't really matter if you steal from us at this point. We have the card that we need to drop next turn. Um, so yeah, I still think the 483 was the best placement in second position. We were able to secure uh, a decent wheat spot in addition to securing the sheep uh, port which ultimately did help us win this match so very happy with the way things turned out uh, they bought a dev card okay yeah so they can't win I really don't see even if you have two secret victory points bring you up to seven you winning this turn either okay eight we got some sheep for eight they're attacking us pretty heavily this match so um, you're able to overcome that eight again sheep okay so let's just uh Let's just drop this. 10 victory points. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It's still showing us the rank of bronze, which doesn't really make sense. Um, that's inaccurate, but we'll see uh, if they continue to make fixes. Uh, but if you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit that like button. Thank you so much for watching. And quick shout out to the channel members, Marcus McCusker. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys later.